In a shared physical environment such as this multi-user augmented reality game, it is possible for users to physically interfere with each other, especially when they are engrossed and not aware of how close they are to each other until they collide. To avoid this kind of unexpected physical interference, we developed a technique called a redirected motion inspired by earlier work on redirected walking. Redirected motion transforms the 3D space in which a user moves their display to direct the display away from the other user's display. As the green player on the right moves his device towards the red player's device, his view location is shifted in the direction of his motion as indicated by the more transparent geometric model offset from the handheld PC. This shift is applied only when the two players are closer than a specified distance and only to a player who is moving toward the other. The inset window at the lower bottom corner shows the augmented reality view seen by the green player through his handheld PC camera. The idea is that if we exaggerate the player's virtual motion in the direction of travel, this could potentially move their virtual position closer to where they want to be without making them travel the full distance. In other words, our technique can cause a player who is moving to stop short and thus could keep the two players farther apart physically. Dominoes that are floating in this third person view are on top of the larger virtual tabletop that the users see. Note that because the real world seen by the handheld PC camera cannot be shifted, shifting the virtual camera location could cause a visual discrepancy between real and virtual worlds that makes the shift obvious to the players. To prevent this, we cover the game board with a virtual texture larger than the size of the board and limit the amount of shifting so that the player will never see the shift effect. The virtual texture also hides the motion of the virtual dominoes relative to the marker array. As a player moves away from the other player, the virtual camera location is incrementally shifted back to the physical camera location. To make this shift as imperceptible as possible, it occurs only when the player is actively moving and is more than a specified distance from the other. To study the effectiveness of redirected motion and whether players are distracted by it, we conducted a within subject study in which 9 pairs of participants played the game shown here. We collected quantitative time and distance data and subjective answers to a post hoc questionnaire. We compared redirected motion against three other interference avoidance techniques, including dimming the display, playing disturbing sounds, and disabling interaction capabilities, along with an unmanipulated control condition in which no technique was applied. Our study showed that redirected motion kept players significantly farther apart than all other conditions and that players could not distinguish the difference between redirected motion and the unmanipulated control condition.